All right, folks. Now, the Hadi Intel folks that didn't, didn't have any sound uh, somewhat apologize for that, but then basically don't. Uh, factual, I guess we got an earthquake there. We'll just open it up, see what this is 2.8, but 2.8 is 2.8. Uh, especially in that close to the coast and stuff like that there. So anyway, you got to go around and start looking at all these uh, details on these. Uh, what they are is basically these things are epidemic hazards. Okay. Now that when I first clicked, I could be possibly wrong on that. There, they have a blank on that one. They're not telling you about it. Now one of them's got like some 12 or, or so deaths, 15 deaths or something like that. Okay. And I think basically if I go to this one, I'm not sure if this is the one that had the deaths on it. But yes, it does. And now it's up to 17, it looks like. 17 people affected. So there are some kind of epidemics breaking out. And when they do epidemic hazards, you don't know what it is. I mean, they could add a local this, that, or whatever. Now, we do know that there's gases uh, that are getting emitted from uh, Earth. And uh, also with all the heat, that there is old viral things that are coming into effect from a long time ago. So that's recent there. I go to, this is... Uh, out here in the Atlantic we have a 5.0 and what I was interested in doing is I'm going to take a look and see what we got going on for possible anything for Bermuda and so forth and so on. I really think that everything will probably be safe though, but let's take a look. They got it as Northern Mid-Atlantic Ridge. It's not the first time we've seen some before. Now they don't show anything on tsunami. So basically we'll look for it. Now I'm probably basically subbing suspicious observers without even asking them or anything like that. He's got a great, great, great one. He's got standard YouTube so we can show his info. I guess when I blow his info, I guess I'll allow him to. And I just want to ask one last thing here. I'll be straight. If you know he puts a list of all the people that died from the Hawaii thing, I will ask him that in the next piece of it. Because I want to make sure that he can see it. Because if he knows that there's people that died from it, then it's not like he's not going to see it. Because he knows that there's people that died from it. Back here. I mean, it's just massive. I mean, they're in conjunction, they're in conjunction, they're in conjunction, and they tie into all the 8.0 magnitude and higher quakes. Okay? So, factual, actual, we've got it nailed. And Albino's, uh, Albino's actual sechi shots that I've showed you, the meatball out there, actually exists. And there's tons of this soft, that soft, trying to Ask Menagera, the diet of the meatball out there, is it just a gas, this, that? It's not. I've even showed where they are trying to propaganda you into believing that there is actual something out there that's a gas, and it's not. The meatball is the meatball, and there's all this other Jupiter, Jupiter, Uranus, Neptune, full moon, conjunction, 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 all this these things happen all the time, and we get those quakes, okay? And I apologize to Suspicious. Basically, I'm just promoting him, and it's factual. There's tons of us out there that agree, and we've had scientists know about this, brother. and there it is. Suspicious O, I think he uses a z uh, number zero instead of O for observers, but anyway, that's his, and I'll go to his site real fast, and you need to check him out. He gives you a two-minute every day of factual Hey, like I do. Okay. So, and then he's had some three-minute news and stuff like that. So I'm gonna go check out what he's got in a second. So check him out. He does a real quick, snappy uh, layout of what's going on in the world, ladies and gentlemen. Now, what Bino's gonna show you too, folks, is yesterday will take us down to just looking at Earth, and we're gonna show you that basically the Wyoming quakes yesterday, and I'm gonna show you on RSOE <coughs> that they're there, actual factual data. And as you see, we're going in here. Oh, and now they put the 4.5 back up on there. Okay, now I did notice that yesterday, too, and I was talking to some people there. And if they originally it would have shown up as a 4.0 here on Earthquake 3D, which is titled the USGS, okay? So then, uh, for a while, a long time, they didn't have it on USGS, so I should be able to tape it. Didn't think they had to tape it. But this took, it was so exciting.
quakes to hit that area. Just to show you that he also <laughs> saves me looking it up. And there was even one up in Ontario, up in Hudson Bay. Okay? So he's got a lot of good neighbors. I don't want to – so go visit his and watch his video. Go watch this one. Every day, every day he's got a nice quick two-minute, and he did a three-minute a while ago. So there you go. Up in Ontario, Canada, ladies and gentlemen, there's also a three-point-something up there, 3.9. Okay, so we were hella busy with quakes yesterday.
Now, folks, I love YouTube, and basically everybody's got their choice on there, but you can see the ass menagerie of crap that 